We had a very moving event today with uh, 64 students who are terror victims that we have adapted and embraced together with the Terror Victims Association in Israel. And it's really moving, especially in light of the constant uh, ongoing terror attacks uh, in Israel. This is just a, a heartwarming for us to see that we are part of uh, bringing people into uh, rehabilitation by uh, equipping them and giving them the tools to go to university, go to colleges and get education like uh, lawyers, engineers, electrical engineers, teachers, all sorts of professions. It's amazing to see because these people want to rehabilitate, they want to succeed in their life, they want to build their life again, and it's just so amazing to see that. And AB is here with us, he's the head of the uh, Terror Victims Association in Israel, and he himself is a terror victim. He lost his wife and his son, his wife was pregnant, and uh, it's just so amazing to see how he himself uh, is building his life so amazingly. Two children that have been uh, severely injured and they themselves have been rehabilitated and are successful in their own profession. And uh, AB himself has been uh, doing tremendously uh, good with all his difficulties, physical di difficulties. And we just see how uh, he's so blessed and he's now blessing others and we are together embracing these people how successful they are and how they're building their life uh, in a professional manner and also in an emotional manner you know in israel it's a beautiful country nobody can predict what's going to happen the next minute as badia said it was so emotional that we just had one boy. He lost his brother 7th of October in the Nova party. He has post-trauma. We just gave a scholarship right now. He's going to be a student. Maybe he'll be a lawyer, just because of Batya. Helping those kids, as I told Batya, you know, you should be blessed by Almighty God. Whatever you think, they're all your kids. And you're trying to help these guys and I have really no words to thank you. Thank, thank you, you for much. allowing us to uh, be part of this. And uh, the, the truth of the matter is like A.B. is saying, even this morning as we were preparing to do this event, there was a, a terror attack. Yeah, terror. And it's like she went to walk oh. in the park with her dog and her husband, I think, and they were both uh, stabbed and uh, murdered. So this is like unbelievable. This is the reality that we live in and we have to get up and, and, and just look at the face of this ugly terror and just say we are trying to uh, embrace these people and give them the strength and the tools that they need to be successful in their future and to have a future because there is a future.